I you listen to a, a lot of a lot of motivational videos. I'm I'm a Lakers fan. I got a Bulls hat on right now. It's because of, you know, it, it matched. Yeah. But matched I'm a up. Lakers fan, more so a Kobe fan. Mm -hmm. And I listened to a video and he was like, um, if you wake up in the morning, you're truly happy about what you're doing, mm -hmm. then that's how you know that you're doing the right thing for yourself in life. Like yeah, if you yeah. wake up in the morning and all right, you're not making money from this, but you truly enjoy doing it, mm -hmm. then maybe that's what you're supposed to keep doing. And it will eventually fall through. A lot of these overnight yeah, yeah. successes that you think were overnight, they've been around for five, five, ten years before mm -hmm. I actually popped off like TikTok. I heard it was around since like 2010 or even probably before that. I could be wrong. Don't don't quote me on that. But TikTok just pop, popped off mm -hmm. after being around for so long. Like all these companies that are big now, they were around for a minute. So. Mm -hmm. You wake up and you love what you do. Maybe that's your passion. You, you yeah, wake yeah. up and you love it. That's what you got to do. So keep doing it. It'll keep pop off up. eventually. That's exactly. what a lot of people's got. That's what a lot of people have wrong with them. Like they 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 stop. And this is I'm giving a um. I'm gonna tell people something right now that I wish people told me when I was doing this Poland Springs thing. And if you know me with the high school with me, you know about Poland Springs. Mm -hmm. It's, it's not nothing. Springs it ain't a, nothing new. That was a, that was a motive. It ain't nothing new. So what? You see, I got it on me still. Still, I still got day. it. And they ain't give me nothing. Years later. Yeah, I ain't give. They ain't give me nothing except a shirt and a what a follow. But I was um, I wish people told me that don't stop, yo. Mm -hmm. don't stop. Like don't Never stop, quit. don't stop. Mm -hmm. I stopped, bro. Cause I'm like they not messing with me. Why am I? Yeah, why yeah. do I keep jacking them? Mm -hmm. And they just, they're not even giving me no... It gives you like that. If you were to keep going, how far could this really have gone? And how far? And yeah. Man, bro. When nah, I tell you, When I tell you, bro, like... I got you on that. You think back at the things that you did, and I always look back at my life and I try to find the hints. Like, yo, right as of right now, I look back in life and be like, yo, I try to find the hints that God gave me mm -hmm. to lead me the right direction. Mm -hmm. So I'm like... And there's so many different directions it could have gone. And I'm like, I look back and I'm like, yo, why did I stop? Because you don't know, you don't never know who's watching. No cap. You, you, exactly. You, People, don't, yo. you don't know who's in the stands. You don't know who's watching. I was watching the Tyler Creative video and he was like, yo, I found some of my boys yo. that are doing great now off of YouTube videos that had six views. You don't know who's watching. You do don't. not. Yeah, yeah. Message, message to my people, bro. Mm -hmm. Message to all my millionaires out there. Do not stop. Mm -hmm. Please, literally, please don't stop. Don't stop, cause and and it's also if you feel like you want to stop, if you feel like you want to, you can't keep going. The thing is with what we're doing and, and what the brand is and like posting that other video, you gotta really want it. And it's like a matter of how bad do you want it? Yeah. Do you want to keep? You want to keep going? Do you want to, you know, get to where? Cause if you don't, if you don't keep going, like yeah. you're not gonna get there. You really just gotta tap in and just do it. Just keep on staying consistent and yeah. also that's another thing that kobe has said like you know oh he was the first you know kobe. first one in the gym last yeah, one GG. in the gym and then when he, he has said that too and then when his boys he took they took him out for a night i, I remember this um when a friend of mine told me about this I remember. He, he, they took, they took him, him out. out he came back at two he woke them up at four in the morning yeah, and said y'all going to the gym you, i don't care if we just got home at that's two in the fact. morning you know it's more of just keeping fact. that. Because he yeah. said, I did what you wanted to do, right? Yeah, so now. So now you got to come to the gym with me right now. do what I do every day. Lock in and do the same thing. Some people some people are not built for that lifestyle, bro. Some yeah. people are not built for this. Mm -hmm. Some people are not built to run a business. Running a business takes a lot of takes a lot of work. Yeah, yeah. And shout out to my business partner and my girlfriend, future wife, Linda Hurry. Sure. Like, without her, I don't even know if I'll be able to mm -hmm. keep this brand up. Yeah, Like, yep. she does a lot in the business that... Even with the website, congratulations to her too because she just graduated graduated college. So yeah, congratulations yeah. to her. Big That's a big accomplishment. Yes, sir. Um, and you too. Congratulations. I did too. Yeah. Like, look, congratulations, yeah, bro. Yeah, so you know. See when at least. Yeah. So you know she she plays a big role in a uh, million dollar stitch, a huge role, mm -hmm. a huge role. She made the website. Yeah. Uh, she does all the editing, content, like she does all that. So shout out to mm -hmm. her. But um, some people it's it's some people not made for this. But I had to hear yeah, yeah. and I talk to people and be like, yo, I'm con they be content with where they at, mm -hmm. and making this. And there's nothing wrong with that. No, there's not. There's nothing wrong with that. If you're making good money, make that good money, for and sure. just be happy. Like whoever, whatever make you happy, make you happy. But mm -hmm. I know it made me happy, and I know 
I'm not chasing after. There's a quote. Uh, there's a quote that I have on my Facebook. If you go like to the background, the header, it's like I'm not chasing after money. I'm chasing after the freedom that comes with money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know exactly what you're talking like, about. I've heard that before. Yeah. I'm not chasing after. I don't. The money, money made the world yeah, go round. Yeah. I want to live a. I want to live a life of freedom. I want to be free. I want to be able to see and try, see my family, travel mm-hmm. to my family. I got family down south that I want to see that. Exactly. I had that called brothers and sisters, my cousins, my aunts and uncles. Like, I got a little niece. Shout out to Bubba. Shout out to my Bubba, my little niece. Mm-hmm. And happy birthday to my little, uh, my nephew Zaire. Yeah, yeah. And my other nephew. Shout out to Onyx oh, too. Nice. Big O. But, um, yeah, it was just like, I want to be able to put them in a position mm-hmm. to live a lifestyle where they don't have to clock in nowhere. Yeah. And, and not saying that that's bad, but you know, mm-hmm. you know the vibe though. Yeah, for sure. I know definitely the same type of time. I know that money come and go, but I know at the same time with money, I, that's the thing. That's the reason why I work so hard. I do what I got to do because I want to, the same thing as you. I want to put my family in a position to not be on that same position that they were in the past. I want to yeah, yeah. be that first step to generational wealth more so that this way we set for life, not just my life, but in But the you're future. doing it though. Exactly. And that's why I'm so, here. That's why I'm here. And that's why I support you because you're doing it. Mm-hmm. And that's another thing is, like you said, uh, real quick, sorry to cut you off, but good. money come and go, and that's the thing. We got to be able to take that money and and be able to use it to make different experiences because you know, that's I know from you know you know I always travel and that's a big thing. I I love to travel because there's so many different experiences that come with it, and I want you to be able to do that too because I know like you just said you want to go down south. You want and that, there's a lot of different experiences that come yeah. with going down south. You're gonna see a whole bunch of different uh, like a whole different vibe whole different people in terms of their energy like people yeah. out here they're haters they, yeah. they hate when you go out there you you see people and they just chill they say hey what's up you yeah. know they make sure you're good and that's something that i've realized in this last trip when i went this week last, like two weeks last weekend two weeks ago yeah. something like that um is i just like i met people that i could have a conversation with easily without being hated on or be yeah. like why are you talking to me type yeah. Right? but yeah so life is beautiful bro yeah. um it's just like you gotta you gotta experience life like you said traveling and doing all that is a great way to experience life i wouldn't say people out here is haters Not re- yeah. it's just i i was um i was talking to my boy the other day and it was just like some people don't see what you see mm-hmm. a lot of people uh, yeah. don't see the a lot of people don't see what you see bro mm-hmm. like your your vision and your dreams is for you mm-hmm. sometimes it takes sometimes it takes you bring it to the forefront for them to actually be like oh i can do that yeah yeah oh he did that oh you can't do that he wasn't lying Mm -hmm. some people can't see what you see bro so you can't be mad at them for not seeing that a lot of people Mm -hmm. not going to support you in the first years of your business a lot of Mm -hmm. people not going to support you in the first months first couple days they have to you have to show them Mm -hmm. the way a lot of people you have to show them what you're doing what you're into and kind of open their mind up to a different uh, yeah, yeah a different yeah, a different yeah, way different of thinking, way of thinking bro because they're on the they're on that same mindset that they was in the past they're not moving on they're not growing into that better mindset every, each and every day bro you know what you know exactly and also scratch the hate i mean it is the haters but i meant like in terms of that aspect i just meant more of like you know not liking like not quick to have a conversation with just anyone you know be friendly like it's this this life is too it's too short to be having that mindset of, oh, I can't just have a simple conversation with a person yeah. I don't know. You know, there's a lot that can come from a conversation. You yeah. can make a connection that can last a lifetime that's easily. A and that's that's my biggest thing is I want to be in an area where I could I could do that. And people out here, it's just not like that. You know, people are stuck in uh, Connecticut where there's not much to do out here. There's not much to see. But, you know, I mean, just make the most of it. There's a lot of people here still. There's people that you can have conversations with and connect with. So. Like let's just let's build our community, bro. Instead of yeah. like Instead talking, tear it down and tearing talk it, it down, down and leaving like people from Connecticut leave. Like there's a lot of celebrities that you wouldn't even know that's from Connecticut. Connecticut. And like wait, what? And it's from like Connecticut? it's like Connecticut is one of the richest states, and it's like people be like, yo, I can Connecticut stink, Connecticut. But why don't you build it up though? You everybody leaving yeah, going yeah. to LA. Cause the people down there, in LA, you see people with LA tattoos, like yeah, yeah. they LA hats, like they from LA, and they really not. 
Feel me, New York. Places out here, like. New York, be like, yo, I'm from New York, bro. Yeah, yeah. I'm from New York, bro. I want to get to a point where I'm like, yo, I'm from Connecticut, and you know Nigga, what I'm yeah. talking about. Like, I'm from yeah. Connecticut. People from Georgia be like, I'm from the A. I'm from CT, bro. I, I, I rep yeah, that. I rep that, that to every, the. Yeah. I'm a Bloom. I'm a Bloomfield. I'm a Bloomfield man. So, I'm mm -hmm. from Bloomfield, Connecticut. Like that's where I was born. Not born, but that's where I was raised yeah, up at in raised. Bloomfield. So it's like, I'm from CT. What am I gonna do about it? Mm -hmm. Build it up. Like I'm from mm -hmm. CT. I'm gonna put. The, I'm a, I want to implement, implement things from where I can make CT an attraction where we have that one thing. All right, guys. So it just cut off real quick. After every 20 minutes, it cuts off. But well, we're gonna get back into it. And we was talking about implementing, so implementing we can get back. like I want to implement. I want to plant seeds um, everywhere in the world. To be honest, but why not start from my community where I was, where I grew up at? Mm -hmm. I'm in CT. I was born in C I was born in CT, and I was I'm still in CT. Mm -hmm. What else can you do? What else can you do about it? Yeah, yep. And that's something I've been scared about too. Honestly, is repping that I'm from CT because like CT there's not much out here. I've been embarrassed about doing that but you know that's something you know i gotta really realize like it's where i'm from i can't change it like you said like yeah. you know you can't really change it it's where i'm from and yeah. that's what i, I want to continue to be better at that and rep that because i know like being from ct yeah it's it's not the best place it's not the you know but it's it's where i'm from and i gotta be a, a better man when it comes to that and that's what i'm been trying to do is like just really yeah, in, you know, A60 man, A6 CT, so. come on, bro. I'm yeah, out here. Yeah. I'm out here. Shout out to Annoyed. Mm -hmm. uh, that'd be. Uh, I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out all the celebrities that's out here. But shout mm -hmm. out to Annoyed. I know WWE be down here. I didn't even know that. Oh either. yeah, yeah. They're, they're, they're headquarters out there in um, Stanford, I think. I know some old yeah, school. Yeah. I don't know if it was. I don't think it's Jagged Edge. Is it Jagged Edge or? It was one of them old school groups mm -hmm. that's from out here. Like, shout out to CT, bro. Yeah, shout, out, yeah. shout out to CT. A60, bro. Shout out. Mm -hmm. And you want to know something that makes up a lot of our wealth is like those wealthy areas like Stanford and Greenwich and mm -hmm. all that. That's that biggest, that's where all the money is. And that's where I kind of want to be. Yeah. Eventually, I want to see, I see myself in that area because there's a lot out there. There's a lot yeah. of money out there. But for sure, definitely. So, how was your life growing up versus how it is now? All right, so my life growing up versus how it is now. I live, I lived a pretty, a pretty good life. Uh, I would say, middle class, everything that I wanted, mm -hmm. I got. I didn't really want for much, but my mom made sure that I had everything I needed. Um, I was pretty sheltered. I didn't really go through too much. I didn't really see too much things that I didn't, that I didn't need to see. Like I was, I was a homebody, still in my homebody. Um, I have, I grew up in a house with my mom and my sister. Shout out to my sister Taylor mm -hmm. uh, and my mom Carol. Love you both to death. If I don't, I don't say that a lot, but I mm -hmm. need to give you flowers too, because without y'all, I wouldn't be where I'm at. I mm -hmm. was raised by. Without my mom too. Yeah, like, shout out mom. Yeah, shout out, shout out moms, mom. because without our moms, we 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 wouldn't be in the positions we in for sure. That's like, a fact. And my father, my father was in my life too. So shout out to my dad, yeah. Rakaton, uh, Bari. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I grew up in a household with my my, my mother and my sister. Um, yeah, they they did a they did a good job with raising me. My sister put me on with every, like everything. I, I mm -hmm. give her flack about it though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But swag, everything, Jordans, how to dress, polo. She gave yeah, yep. music. Yeah, yep. That's a good she, thing about an older sister, right? Older yeah. sister, yeah. She, I'm the, I'm the baby, I'm the baby, I'm the baby of uh baby of the family. I don't know how many. So I, 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 yeah, I, I'm yeah. I'm you like my mom? My mom had, my mom's the baby out of like ten siblings, yeah. nine siblings. So it's the same. I was, I thought I was eleventh, but I might be the, the like the thirteenth, maybe fourteenth. I'm not sure. You're not sure. Shout out to Barry again. <laughs> um, but yeah, all my brothers, I love all my brothers, sisters, and all their kids as well. Yeah, that's yeah. who, that's who I do it for. But um, yeah, I, I grew up. I grew up pretty good, man. And that's what molded me today. That's mm -hmm. what molded me into the person I am today because my mom taught me a lot of values and even even my mom's side of the family down south, like that southern hospitality kind of just grew me into who I am today. Mm -hmm. Like have you been down south? Yeah. Yeah, a south? couple times. A couple where, times. Where, to the to the A or where where was it? Uh North Carolina. North Carolina? I got family in North, okay, North Carolina. Okay. I haven't been to North well, actually yeah, I have I have been to North Carolina. Yeah. But it's the same. Yeah, I've been there. Um, when I was 
I was what's it called for schools and stuff for college. I was looking out there in Duke and mm-hmm. and just North Carolina, yeah, yeah. UC. I was looking out there and I was just there. Yeah. Was yeah. So was, uh, North Carolina lit. They got a lot of uh, they got a lot of great people out there. Mm-hmm. Strangers. Yeah. Just okay. mad nice. Just mad nice. nice. Shout out to, shout out to North yep. Carolina as well.